to Moose 78 back at you with another episode of Stories from the Road. We are on episode number 10. Hope everyone's doing well today, by the way. Just real quick, want to thank everyone for the continued support for coming in every week, watching the videos, liking, sharing, all that good stuff. Really appreciate it, guys. Look forward to what the future holds. But today we got a lot of stuff to talk about. A lot of stuff been going on about the last week or so out in the uh, gaming industry and the tech industry. Of course, the Battlefield 1 trailer has dropped. Everyone's checked that out. The internet lost its mind over the Call of Duty Infinite Warfare trailer. NVIDIA dropped their two new flagship cards, the 1070 and the 1080. Sounds like the division is going to get patched here pretty soon, 1.2. It's going to fix some things there, some bugs, some exploits. Loot's going to be a little bit better. There's a lot to talk about today, guys, so let's strap in and continue our run up to Nevada. Going up to Battle Mountain, I believe. Shafts. And just real quick, uh, before we jump into uh, all the topics this week, what this series is, it's my Let's Play series. Then I just throw in a lot of random discussion like we're going to this week. jump right into it and we will start off by talking a little bit about the uh, Battlefield 1 trailer a lot of speculation a lot of rumors out there in the days leading up to that uh, there were some leaks early on the day of the release on what it was going to be it did end up being true it is a World War 1 theme shooter people happy about that. I know a lot of people were wanting like World War II or modern, but uh, after the trailer... Ew. Yo, gonna go around me. Yo, oh, damn. Woo -hoo. Thank you, come again. But uh, a lot of people are expecting or wanting World War II or modern. It ends up being uh, World War I. And the trailer of that was, holy cow. I don't know about you guys, but that, that trailer smacked me right in the feels. Game looks, the game footage they showed looked absolutely amazing. The music to it was absolutely amazing. The presentation, all that stuff was just phenomenal. And I seen something on Twitter uh, this morning that that is the most liked trailer in YouTube history. Yeah. I think last I seen it was 1.3 million likes. It's probably well over that by now. That's insane. 20 million views. This guy is looking pretty cool. This guy is looking pretty cool. game lives up to the hype right now because, boy, last Friday after that reveal, that hype train took out of the station like a bat out of hell. And we all kind of, we've all kind of lived through that with Battlefield 4. A lot of people were pretty excited about that, had the feels, all, all that same stuff that uh, is going on now. We all know the 
problems that plagued Battlefield 4 for the first year of its existence. It was just a hot freaking mess. So I'm cautiously optimistic. A lot of the stuff that I'm hearing I like. They're kind of changing up the classes a little bit. I'm sure you guys watched plenty of videos on that by now. couple battlefields the assault class has been V class it's you know you've had the best weapons in the game with the assault rifles you've had the med bags you've had the defibrillators you've you've had all the power on the battlefield all in one class and it sounds like they're kind of spreading that out a little bit I got to go into a whole lot of detail on that but uh, class balance is definitely a good thing just sounds like it's gonna be a pretty interesting game quite a bit different from what we've had the last couple battlefields so I'm looking forward to that that comes out this fall October 21st of course you can pre-order you can get the special edition whatever to get a few days early access on the 18th so needless to say uh, the big battlefield reveal last week was a huge success now the flip side of that uh, the competitor to battlefield call of duty they announced their uh, latest game recently as well infinite warfare but they also announced that they're going to do a remaster of modern warfare 2 a lot of people were excited about that until they found out they had to buy infinite warfare to get the remastered version so that turned a lot of people off and a lot of people just kind of lost it. And I think that is now one of the most disliked trailers in YouTube history. Just a lot of people, sounds like they're upset. It sounds like it's another, I've never played the Call of Duty game, so. Sounds like it's another uh, futuristic shooter. I believe it's the third one in a row that's uh, future future themed. And this one even goes out into space a little bit. So a lot of people upset about that. Some uh, Jimmy's were definitely rustled. And during the uh, BF1, Battlefield 1 uh, stream and the reveal and everything, a lot of people were hashtagging uh, Got it, got it trend a little bit. Uh, rest in peace, COD. I don't think that's going to happen, honestly. You're still going to have your people that are your diehard Call of Duty fan base, just like you are Battlefield, just like you are any other game. Hey, what are you doing? No, 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 no. No. point here. Battle Mountain discovered. Hello, Battle Mountain. I'm assuming this is it. Fly jumps. Still here? <laughs> Back out here with a load. Let's check the freight market real quick. These loads. What's there? What's that? Sawdust. Panels. So Bakersfield. Yeah. I don't know 
I said it uh, last week, but I'm really digging this uh, map mod. This map pro map by uh, Heavy Alex. Just adds a little something, something extra to the game. Spices it up a little bit. back here. Bakersfield. But uh, what are your guys' thoughts? Kind of get back to the discussion here a little bit. What are your guys' thoughts on the Battlefield 1 trailer, on the COD trailer? Are you guys interested in either game? Leave a comment down below. Love hearing from you guys.
right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and start to wrap this one up. Uh, be sure to check back next Tuesday as we continue our discussion. Uh, we'll get into the NVIDIA stuff a little bit more and a couple other things. So you guys pretty much know the routine by now. If you like today's video, go ahead and give it a like and a share. It just helps me out a bunch. If you're new to the channel, take a look around. And if you're not already subscribed, please consider doing so now. But guys, as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting. Thanks for hanging out. We'll catch you in the next one. Take care. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please take a moment and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want to follow me over on the Twitters, click on the link in the description. And if you're looking for great gaming gear at an affordable price, click my NoScope affiliate link also down in the description. And if you want more ATS content, click on the video to check out my Stories from the Road playlist. Thanks, and we'll catch you in the next one.